Well, first we had the fiscal cliff. Now the sequester, a package of spending cuts scheduled to kick in tomorrow. Social Security could take a hit, and Shimon County AARP members are urging lawmakers to act now. WENY TV's Tanja Reiki joins us live with their story. Tanja. We're not in Scott. Right now, 2.4 million senior citizens in New York receive Social Security benefits. Any cuts could impact spending for seniors and younger generations in a big way. These AARP members are worried about talks in Congress to change the formula used to determine Social Security's annual cost of living adjustment. It's called Chained CPI and assumes people settle for cheaper substitutes when consumer prices go up. But there are no substitutes for things like medicine, housing, and utilities. There are many people that are below the average and when we need help because the cutting will be really devastating for so many people. Change CPI was left out of December's fiscal cliff deal, but may come to a vote in Congress as part of a deal to avoid the so-called sequester. I'm 86 years old, and my uh, part of the income that I have is Social Security. It's a little over $1,200, and I have a small pension, but if they raise or lose our Social Security or take it away from them. I don't know how I'm going to make out. Ron Rayner has a son and daughter and grandchildren who say they're not planning on Social Security, so he fights to avoid anything that could result in cuts. To protect it so that it isn't, because this is a really a big safety net for a lot of people. In Shimon County, a change CPI means close to $42 million in Social Security cuts. Live in the studio, Tanja Reiki, WENY-TV News.